Grasslands were home to creatures of immense strength and unrivaled fortitude. In the heart of these ancient landscapes, a true titan ruled supreme. Join us on an expedition through time as we delve into fossil discoveries and explore the intriguing theories surrounding its extinction. Dodicurus, an armored behemoth of the ancient grasslands, stands as a fascinating creature with distinct physical characteristics and adaptations belonging to the group of Glyptodons, a now extinct lineage of heavily armored mammals. Dodicurus left its mark in prehistoric ecosystems with its massive size and unique bony armor. Dodicurus captured the attention of researchers and enthusiasts alike. Dodicurus flourished in the grasslands and savannas of South America during the Pleistocene Epoch, providing valuable insights into its habitat and distribution. This armored behemoth roamed the vast expanses of these grassy landscapes, adapting to the diverse environments within its range. From open grasslands to more wooded areas, Dodicurus displayed a level of adaptability that allowed it to thrive in various conditions. Fossil records and paleontological findings have revealed the presence of Dodicurus in regions such as Argentina, Uruguay, and Brazil, showcasing its distribution across parts of South America. Dodicurus boasted a remarkable anatomy and an impressive suit of armor, setting it apart as a unique and well-adapted creature. With a robust and bulky body, it reached lengths of about 13 feet and weighed up to 3,000 kilograms. The most striking feature of Dodicurus was its extraordinary armor, consisting of thick bony plates fused together to form a protective shell covering its back, sides, and tail. These armor plates, known as osteoderms, acted as a shield against potential predators and provided support and rigidity to the creature's body structure. The osteoderms were intricately designed, featuring a mosaic pattern of interlocking plates that allowed for flexibility and movement while maintaining strength and defense. These body plates were also often adorned with spikes or knobs, further enhancing the defensive capabilities of Dodicurus. The tail of Dodicurus was particularly impressive, with a massive club-like structure at the end, composed of several fused osteoderms. This tail club, weighing up to 200 kilograms, was likely used as a formidable weapon to fend off predators or engage in intraspecific combat. Beneath its armored exterior, Dodicurus had a relatively compact and stout body with short but powerful limbs. Its sturdy limbs and specialized feet suggest that it was adapted for a slow and steady gait, enabling it to support its massive weight and navigate the grassland environment effectively. Dodicurus' feeding habits and diet provide intriguing insights into its role in the prehistoric ecosystem. As a herbivorous mammal, Dodicurus relied on a plant-based diet to sustain its massive size and energy requirements. It primarily consumed vegetation, such as grasses, leaves, and fruits that were abundant in the grassland and savanna habitats inhabited. Its specialized teeth and jaws were well adapted for processing plant matter efficiently. With a set of ever-growing incisors and molars, Dodicurus had the ability to continuously replace worn-out teeth, ensuring a functional and effective chewing apparatus. Its incisors were used for cropping vegetation, while the molars were responsible for grinding and crushing plant material. This combination of dental adaptations allowed Dodicurus to extract maximum nutritional value from its food sources. To support its herbivorous lifestyle, Dodicurus likely had a large gut capable of fermenting and breaking down fibrous plant material, similar to other herbivorous mammals. This fermentation process aided in the digestion of tough plant fibers and extraction of nutrients from the plant matter consumed. Additionally, the massive tail club with its fused osteoderms could have been used in defense or for intraspecific combat where individuals competed for resources or mates. One prominent theory proposes that climate change played a significant role in the extinction of Dodicurus. During the late Pleistocene epoch, the Earth experienced significant environmental fluctuations, including shifts in temperature and precipitation patterns. These changes could have resulted in alterations to the grassland habitats that Dodicurus relied upon, potentially leading to habitat loss, reduced food availability, or changes in vegetation composition. Such shifts in the environment could have had detrimental effects on the survival and reproduction of Dodicurus populations. Thank you for joining us on this captivating journey into the world of Dodicurus. We hope you enjoyed this video.